Oh, who permitted you to come onto the stage? Now, I understand your admiration for my august self, but I must ask you to keep to the rules. All right, all right, it is not my intent to reprimand you. There is no need to state your name. Just be off with you. Do not distract me from my performance. <laughs> oh, do not jest. Can you not feel it? I am Fosalor. The eyes of countless Fontanians are upon me. I must, at all times, display the utmost elegance and nobility. Audience. The performance is experiencing a technical difficulty, but worry not. The guards shall resolve it soon. <sighs> Faster? Hey, what gives? The audience is still watching me, you know. Guards? Wait, where are the guards? Guards! Farina. Farina. Huh? Uh, who's that? Uh, who's calling me? Where are you? Be not nervous. Be not afraid. I am before you. Wait a moment. You're... near me? How can this be? Hmm. <laughs> Mirror you, huh? You know what? That's not bad. Let's go with that. Mirror me. W what do you wish to say? The prophecy. Have you heard of it? What prophecy? <sighs> Wait. I know. I think. I don't know why, but it's... In my head somehow, the people will all be dissolved into the waters, and only the Hydro Archon will remain, weeping on her throne. Only then will the sins of the people of Fontaine be washed away. Oh, <laughs> very good. You know it well. What's going on? I can't seem to remember anything clearly the only thing i know for sure is this prophecy will it really come to pass <laughs> yes it will and that is why i've come to you disaster will come to fontaine sooner or later things will develop just as the prophecy declared there is no escaping it but doesn't that mean everyone will die? 
I am a Fontanian just like them. Will I dissolve too? <laughs> oh, don't worry. Magical meetings exist in this world precisely to give people a chance to turn things around. It is the reason why you met me today. I will tell you how to save everyone, but you may have to suffer somewhat. Oh, oh, so there's still hope after all. Goodness, you frightened me. You spoke so much and with so much certainty. As for the suffering, well, I will admit that the first thing that came to mind was, why do I have to be the one to suffer? But if the prophecy will come true, I'll also die anyway, right? So if I've already met you as my magical meeting in this world, if there were scales, with all the people of Fontaine on one side, and my pain on the other. Is it not obvious where the scale should tilt? <laughs> you truly are the perfect human. My ideal. I suppose this would also be the justice that belongs to you. Huh? Don't worry, it's nothing. Listen well. Fontaine has just lost its Hydro Archon. I need you to play a role. That of the new Archon. Play as... a god? That's right. You must begin a never-ending masquerade. You must never let anyone suspect your identity. If you can keep it up, then I shall have my way of defying this prophecy. But should your identity be revealed, then all hope will be lost. But how will I do this? A human assuming the role of a god without being exposed? Don't worry. What you must do is not to turn yourself into a real god. You simply need to play the role of a god as humans imagine them to be. Being a human yourself, I'm sure you already know what such an entity would be like. Remember, your true challenge will not be pursuing divinity, but contending against humanity. Um, I'm still not sure I understand, but I'll try. I'll try to do this. So, how long am I going to have to play this role? To accomplish this mission, you will have to stay on the stage for many, many years. You will endure and not grow old until your task ends. But, I promise you, all will eventually end in a magnificent and dramatic trial and everyone will be saved. A trial, huh? How exciting. I'll be looking forward to it. <laughs>